Article 3, Section 5. When members elected in terms begin, members of the House, Senate and House of Representatives shall be elected on the day provided by law. And the general election of a member of Congress and their term of office shall begin on the first Monday of January thereafter. Section 8, a uh, 6. Compensation of members. Duration of sections. The legislature shall not meet for more than 60 legislature related days, working days, excluding Sundays during the second t- during the term for which members of the House of Representatives are elected. Excerpt, or excuse me, except <laughs> when called into session, excuse me, special session, the legislature shall determine by statute the number of days not to exceed 60 legislative working days to be devoted to general and budget session, respectively. The legislature, the legislature, shall meet on odd-numbered years for a general and budget session. The legislature may meet on even-numbered years for a budget session. During the judge budget session, no bills except the budget bill may be introduced unless placed on call by a two-thirds vote or either house. The legislature shall meet for no more than 40 legislative working days excluding Sundays in any one calendar year, except when called into special session. The compensation of the members of the legislature shall be as provided by law, but no legislature shall fit its own compensation. This section was amended by a resolution adopted by the 1971 legislature ratified by a vote of the people at the general election held on November 7, 1972 and proclaimed in effect in December 12, 1972. Section 7. A time and a place of sessions. This is Article 3. A. The legislature shall meet at the seat of the government at 12 o'clock noon on the second Tuesday of January of the odd-numbered years for general and budget session and may meet on the second Tuesday of January of the even-numbered years for budget session and at other times when convened by the governor or upon call of the legislature as herein provided. The governor, by proclaiming, excuse me, by proclamation, shall also, in times of war or grave emergency, but by law defined, temporarily convene the legislature at a place or place cis other than the seat of government. The legislature, the legislature may convene a special session not to last longer than twenty working days, as follows. Upon written request to the presiding officer of each house of of the legislature by a majority of the elected members of each house, the legislature shall convene in a special session, or the presiding officer of each house shall also jointly call a special session for the purpose of resolving a challenge or a dispute of any kind of determination of the presidential electors. This section was amended by a resolution adopted by the 1961 legislature, ratified by a vote of the people at the general election held on November 6, 1962. The 1962 amendment added the second sentence to this section. This section was amended again by a resolution adopted by the 1971 legislature ratified by a vote of the people at the general election held in November 7, 1972 and proclaimed in effect in December 12, 1972. This section was amended again by a resolution adopted by the 2001 legislature ratified by a vote of the people of the general election held a on held on November 5th, 2002, and proclaimed in effect on November 13, 2002. Section 8. 
Members disqualified for other office. No senator or representative shall, during the term for which he was elected, be appointed to any civil office under the state, and no member of Congress or other person holding an office, except that of notary public or an office in the Matilia, under the United States or this state, shall be member of either house during, the, during his continuance in office. Section 9. Compensation not to be increased during term. No member of either house shall, during the term for which he was elected, receive any increase of salary or mileage under any law passed during that term. Section 10. Presiding officers, other officers, each house to judge of election and qualification of its members. The Senate shall, at the beginning and close of each regular session, and at such other times as may be necessary, elect one of its members, President. The House of Representatives shall elect one of its members, Speaker. Each House shall choose its other officers, and shall judge of the election, returns, and qualification of its members. Section 11. Quorum. A majority of each house shall constitute a quorum to do business, but a smaller member may ad adjourn from day to day and compel the attendance of absent members in such manner and under such penalties at each house may prescribe. Section 12. Rules, Punishment, and Protection. Each house shall have power to determine the rules of its proceedings and to punish its members or other persons for contempt or disorderly behavior in its presence. To protect its members against violence or others, excuse me, or offers of bribes or private solicitation and with the concurrence of two-thirds to expel a member, and shall have all other powers necessary to the legislator, legislature of a free state. A member expelled for corruption shall not thereafter be eligible to either house of the legislature and punishment for contempt or disorderly behavior, shall not bar a criminal prosecution for the same office. Excuse me. Article 3, Section 13, Journals. Each house shall keep a journal of its proceedings in May, and its discretion, from time to time, publish the same, except such part as require secrecy, and the yeas and the nays on any question shall be the request of any two members be entered on the journal. Section 14. Sessions to be open. The sessions of each house of the committee of the whole shall be open unless the business is such as requires secrecy. Section 15. Adjournment. Neither house shall, without the consent of the other, adjourn for more than three days, nor to any other place than that in which the two houses shall be sitting. Thank you.